There we go. Oh my gosh, we have Steven Santoli as a lizard watching. Who runs that account? I've seen that account so many times now. Oh, uh, that's so after Andrew Tate wins round one. Can we watch him? Wait. Actually, I don't even know which account he's on. Was he on Shark? I didn't even realize if he was. Uh, would you say there's no way to build Brandon to compete? Should I let the deck go? Uh, yeah, Phantom Nightmare. Yeah, there, there is no way for that deck to compete, to be honest. Like, the Snake Eye cards are just so good. They give you, like, 20 bodies for no reason. And then the Charmers are broken. Said you're watching them. Oh. Okay, go ahead. Spell and Trap Zone. Original Send. Ash Blossom that. Rhoda, so they're playing Rescue Waves, most likely. Yeah. Okay, okay. That makes sense why the, you know, Bonfire went for Populous and not for, like, Snake Eye Ash also. And then Normal Summon Airlifter. Effect. They're thinking on that, though. Oh? Okay. Imperm? I was gonna say, do we see, like, a Chain Emergency? Just Absolute Punish? Just Game? Uh, I mean, they have SP at the bare minimum, right? Well, I guess they have more than that at the bare minimum. They have, like, Link 4 with Princess in Graveyard if they want to go for that. Or they could go for SP. I don't know. It's kind of nice getting hit with Ash Blossom right now. Like, it's a good hand trap, but, like, at the same time, it's a fire in the graveyard for you to heat a take. So, like, that's kind of beautiful. Uh, what up, my boy? What's up? What's up? It's at 13 now. God, yes. Actually, God, no. That means you're out You're out of the Dragon Duels. No, you could have played Dragon Duels. Wait. Wait. Did you play Dragon Duels before? I didn't even think about that. I think, I think I'm going to play Dragon Duels at the 2025 Nationals for the 10-year anniversary. Go back to, to defend my title. Said, not really. Fair, fair. Snake Eyes cooked that wallet. True. Uh, not good enough testing. <laughs> oh, God, yes. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. And then leave main. Alright, so we went SP. We banished the bonfire. Burn that card. Loki, I might play budget Fire King Snake Eye at a regional. Once post Phantom Nightmare comes out, I think I'm going to play a regional. I'm going to play without bonfire or wanted. I mean, it's not going to be complete budget, right? Because, like, SP cost bread and Princess and Populous probably will. So there's, like, no way of getting around those cards. You have to play them. But, like, Bonfire or Wanted, you don't have to have those cards. They are really good, though. Uh, when we getting the Oh God, Yes DB Grinder hoodie? No idea. Oh. Oh. Uh. That's tough. So we only had one play in our hand. Yeah, it's probably just game. Because they can original go search. Uh, thought about streaming on YouTube. Uh, I have before, but I prefer Twitch. I can't stomach using Fire Kings without the best cards. I'd rather just run an off meta deck as optimal as I can. I mean, it's fine though. Like, you don't have to play the stuff. Like, it's still better than playing, like, some bad deck. My opponent didn't show up. Uh, what is your opponent's name? And they can get a game one loss if they haven't shown up. But I can go check. Uh, got Alexa and Manabe. Uh, it doesn't look like either of you are hosting. Man, yeah, it doesn't it doesn't look like anyone's hosting. So uh, you should you should host so that way they can join. Okay, Manabe. Yeah, you, you should host because it's not it's not up yet. It's just a game one loss. It's not it's not a match loss till ten minutes. Okay, go back to this little. But yeah, just rehost, uh, and then yeah, you got like five more minutes to sit around, and then if they don't show up, they are banned from all future tournaments. Oh God, yes. Uh, Alright, next game. 
we're gonna see the fire king deck go first so you know fire king is explosive uh, something like Droll and Lockbird could hurt them a lot, depending on what their hand is. Yeah, okay. Normal opponent probably just go search out Sanctuary. Hopefully they don't have uh hopefully they don't have Droll. Ah, they're thinking. Okay, search Skyburn. Nothing on res. God yes. I'm excited for L-E-D-E, Rakeo looks cool. Nah, I, I haven't read any of that stuff. Anything that comes out after uh, February 28th, I, I'm not reading it until after Vegas. Full focused on Vegas until then. Island destroy Ponix, go search Garunix, Garunix go summon. But I will look at that stuff in the future to be honest. That stuff, I have heard of it. I've heard it's like B Trooper support. So, I love Bee Troopers, so that sounds nice. Hey, shout out to RGB Fox for the sub with the Prime and stuff for two months. Said, shimmy, shimmy, yay, shimmy, yay, shimmy, ya. Yeah. Yes, sir! <laughs> I don't know, I don't even know what that means. Shimmy, uh, uh, is there a YCS tomorrow? Tomorrow? Uh, uh, I don't think so. I think, no, it's next weekend. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, th I think it's next weekend is the Latin American remote YCS and then or maybe that's the weekend after I don't know sometime soon the remote YCS is happening for Latin America and then after that there is uh, what else is there oh there's like the remote dual main event the same weekend for the US and then there's Costa Rica there's the UDS tournament and then there's uh, Vegas. So those, and then there's also the, another remote dual main event. So there's like, you know, six events in the next like month and a half. So they're gonna go normal summon out Hydrant. Okay, so they do have Skyburn. I can go ahead and pop. Costa Rica's uh, first post of Nightmare, then Vegas 3v3. Yeah, there's also the UDS the same weekend at Costa Rica, which, uh, you know, I feel like they're not going to stream Costa Rica because of that, which kind of sucks. I hope they stream both events, but I feel like they're only going to stream the UDS one. They have to stream the UDS one. They're, there's literally, they, they don't have a choice. They have to. Like, they're also, they're spending so much bread on that tourney just from flying all the UDS people out. But that's going to be such a cool event. Uh, you ever been to a Latin American YCS? I have not. I have not. I do want to go to one eventually. But, I don't know, it, it kind of sucks, because like, like there's like a lot of crime down there, and like if you fly to Latin America, you can't like, uh, bring anything to like protect yourself, so like you're kind of just like a sitting duck, like I heard every single person pretty much got robbed at uh, what's it called, the, the last, the last one, not the last one, but uh, I can't even remember what it's called. The one that was on the beach. The one that was on the beach. Like the one that everybody wanted to go to. Cancun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. everybody got robbed at Cancun. Uh, what are your thoughts on Voiceless? Also, my Stovey Torby got damaged. So I'm going to need you to sign a new one. Stovey Torby got damaged. Gosh, that's unfortunate. But uh, thoughts on Voiceless. I need to test the Voiceless Runic deck more. So I got to test that and see how it goes. But Voiceless is is decent. It's decent. But I think it's just like worse than the than the Snake Eye decks. I think those decks are just really good. Oh, uh, you have Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Put them in the dual disc. God yes. Uh, hey Siri, what do you think of Runic Bestial plus Phantom Nightmare? Oh, hey sir, said sir. Uh, I don't think it's good. I think it's OTK like almost every time. No, if you're going to Indianapolis again. The YCS? Yeah, I will. I'm gonna go to uh, Raleigh and Indy for sure. And then wherever Nats is, I'll go there too. Um, they said all three. Uh, up to five. Lol. Yeah. Oh, they're trying to finish from their graveyard, so I didn't know that. Sorry. That's crazy that they didn't know that. That's crazy. 
Because I've used Soul Release many times and I'll leave like one fire in my opponent's graveyard or one dark in the opponent's graveyard just to be able to charm or take it. So heck yeah bro, see you there. Bet. Said nice. I was at the last one, but I didn't catch you. The YCS. I don't. I don't think I went the. Yeah, I didn't go to the last YCS. Or I guess I haven't gone to the last couple YCS's because I guess there was also Baloney. There was Richmond. I didn't go to either of those. I should have gone to Richmond. It just sucked because Richmond was so expensive. It's like dummy expensive. Like, dummy expensive, but I should've went. Uh, must be tripping. I saw you at a Columbus Regionals once, I think. Um, yeah, maybe. Uh, I used to go to Columbus Regionals. They're gonna go Preventer, Banish, Summon. That's good. Which one was a really fun time. Oh, also, I'm doing a protest at the next YCS. At YCS Raleigh, there is a vegan place like right down the block so i'm gonna go there and i'm gonna like eat some burgers and stuff while i'm there i gotta do it i gotta get payback for all the times that the vegans have ruined the meat eaters times i gotta i gotta get payback my opponent's still late okay yeah that'll be uh, a match loss for them then now oh, the columbus regional is on a sunday it's so dead yeah sunday regionals Kinda suck. Gotta try those chicken nachos again. The chicken nachos. Chicken nachos are crazy. For sure. They're gonna go search fire attacker. Uh, bring a grill and barbecue. Nah, I actually, uh, I mean, I know how to grill food once it's on the grill and stuff. Cause like, I've been told like, hey bro, take over the grill. And I'll be like, all right, bet. And I can do that. But I don't, I don't know how to turn on a grill. I don't know if it's as simple as just like, you know, I've seen it done so many different ways. I don't even want to risk it. I don't, I don't like fire. I don't like fire. I didn't use the stove for like eight years at one point because I just don't like fire. Um, I got another somewhere nearby to eat if I can afford Europe to Raleigh travel. Oh yeah, there, there's a lot of vegan places that are around there for sure. Like... I didn't know which place I was going to do the meat eating at. That was sus. But, uh, pause, pause, pause. But I didn't know which place I was going to do the, uh, the meat eating at at the vegan place. But I decided on the, the one that's closest. Because it's just close. Hey, yo, chill, 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 chill. I misclicked, I misclicked, I misclicked. It doesn't count. Uh, heard like a cookout is good for cheap fast food meat eaters. Yeah, I had I had a cookout at uh, I think yeah I think it was like the last time I went to Raleigh. Bro said it twice. Bro, I I, well, I was full committed at that point. But nah, I'm not gonna go out to eat a single time I'm in Raleigh. I actually I don't think I'm gonna go out to eat a single time this year. I don't want takeout. I don't want to go out to eat. I want PB and J's. I make my own food. God yes. Oh, uh, just make sure the vegan spot is like a white person vegan spot. Don't actually get yourself canceled by protesting a religious vegan spot. But honestly, I don't care if it's a religious vegan spot. I don't even know what that means. But I'm just gonna full commit. I'm just gonna walk up in there and I'm gonna just eat some burgers with the boys. God yes. Okay, so I'm gonna go turb. I mean, they, they have to have something to stop this. Like, like, they have to have something like right here. Oh, that's probably just game. Yeah, if that goes through, it's probably just game. Uh, DB ain't broke. He just moves broke, which is how you stack up, I respect it. Yeah, 100%. I, uh, I don't know. Just spending money on food's like a waste. Like, like, you could eat a $1 meal or a $100 meal, and it's still gonna fill you up the same. So there's just no way I'm spending a lot of money on food, like, ever again. Well, I'm gonna eat a burger at a Hindu vegan restaurant. Rip. I don't even know what Hindu is exactly. I've heard of it, but I don't know what it is. Yeah. 
But uh, honestly, it is what it is. True, the food disappears after you eat it too. Yeah. And I don't know. Uh, like cheap food tastes better to me. Like it, if I like, oh my gosh, I went to Fogo multiple times before. If you don't know what Fogo is, it's like a buffet that costs like seventy dollars per person. And like, I swear to God, the food tastes worse because if I have to spend more money on it, the food's gotta taste worse. Because my expectations for it are just out of the sky, like unbelievable. And food just doesn't get that good. Oh, uh, they can't have beef. It's against the religion. They think. They reincarnated people. I think the beefs reincarnated people. Can't eat beef. Ah. Well, uh. Yeah, I don't think the place I'm going to does that. No, hopefully not. Because I'm just going to full commit. I don't want to do too much research into it. I just looked up vegan places near the Raleigh Convention Center. Found the closest one and was like, bet, run it. Go up in the Hida, Hida go take. Okay. Um. I mean, we have Princess still. But. Hmm. Yeah, I was trying to see how we'd have gear in there. I don't know what our next play is. Okay, princess. Summon back out. Oh. Um. Yeah, I'm not sure. I was gonna say, you summon like... No, I actually don't know. Okay. Turbulence. Princess. Link off. And then go summon. Hey, yo, that's wild. What, I said DB about to go to a restaurant? Hey, yo! <laughs> that's crazy. Oh, uh, they're gonna go Raging Phoenix up in the World Sea. And then World Sea go Banish. This just isn't game though, right? I guess it's fine if it's not game. Say so where you want it. Yeah, it resolves and attack under the extra monster zone. <laughs> Accidentally put it back. Wait, do we have a way to get to a level one? I don't. I don't think so. We've already gone through. Huh. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna go princess pop summon, and then they can get uh, Kieran and Raging Phoenix. So like summon, summon. Bring it out. Isn't it just game where Kieran already used their effect? Oh no, Kieran hasn't used its effect. But it's pretty good. That's a that's a summon and a pop. Unless we like Okay, okay. Let's find out. See, I have to, they would have to like mess up with the pop, I guess. Which I kinda Doubt they'll do. I was gonna say, yeah, they'd have to like not pop a monster for them to not have game. They'd have to pop a back row, and there's like no chance you're gonna pop a back row. So they're gonna summon out, gain the attacks. So that's at, uh, oh wait, that popped turbulence, right? Yeah, pop turbulence. Okay, so that's at 58 right now, then. So princess can beat over, they can attack directly. But that's still not game. I feel like. I don't know. So we could have gone like Princess Whale SP Banish. And then banish like Ponix from Graveyard and then SP beat over Kieran. Put him on better have a Fire King in the hand. Maybe you could do that. But attack, attack. Could have gone like Princess, Summon Hydrant, and then Extinguish Pop. It doesn't give you game though, but it's close. Okay, so just make Whale Pass. You know, Princess, Raging Phoenix, both good. Do they have, yeah, they have Hita in the graveyard and Nightmare Phoenix. So they have a few things that can be brought back. Oh, is it a judge call? Slow play call. 
Okay. Let me deal with this. Wait. Okay. Should, uh... Well, okay. Technically, you gotta say it in chat. You can't just, like, DM... Oh, uh, let's see. Declared the effect. So thinking. Okay. Thing. Added. Yeah, I took a minute on that search. Um. I'm trying to see else where they even played a card. Uh, declared the effect. Vanish. Special. Well, that wasn't 30 seconds. Nah, that's just not slow play. I'm not even gonna lie. Okay. But, go back. I mean, if it keeps happening where it takes that long, then yeah. But it was like 10 seconds for the first one. And then it was like a minute for the other one. They're gonna go ahead and summon send. But if it comes up again, let me know. So they went. Uh, add back. Okay. Sanctuary in the island. And send sanctuary for Black Witch. Black Witch effect goes set. It's a goatee. Yeah, go goatee. Goatee kind of crazy. Crazy ass. But... It is there. It is there. If it sets up, it can be nice. I'm gonna go ahead, pop, set original, and then whale summon back out from the graveyard. Yeah, that can bring out the phoenix, which co-links. Which can stop it from being destroyed by battle. Uh, what do you think of the Tri-Brigade Fire King deck? Uh, Post-Phantom Nightmare, unplayable. Pre-Phantom Nightmare, it's pretty good. So, original, send, wait, uh, okay, so I guess they just went activate island, black witch sent a sanctuary from hand, or maybe they already had it face up on the field and I had messed up, because you can only activate one sanctuary per turn, but I wasn't here at the beginning of the turn, so they're gonna go ahead go snake eye ash, back. Say hey, yo. What'd I say? What'd I say? Nah, nah, nah. I didn't say anything sus that time. You're capping, you're capping, you're capping. They're gonna grab Populous, summon Populous. Populous effect might be activated, but probably not since we went through original. Yeah, go ahead. Summon, no effect. Now, there's still like 22 minutes left in the round right now. If they play Animal, they can take Nightmare Phoenix. Uh, I lost Rural Melfi Sprite and got cooked 2 1. Rip. Rip, rip, rip. Oh, they do play Animal. Okay. So Animal can go ahead and take the Nightmare Phoenix. Populous can spell in Traps on itself right there. Uh, they have Snake Eye Ash that can also send the Nightmare Phoenix that we had attached. Oh, we can send Populous, that's fine too. Ah, uh, summon out Flame Birch from hand. Unfortunate. But on that summon, they were thinking but said that's fine. I mean, they have Emergency plus Trap. But they're gonna go Flame Birch to spell in Trap Zone. They're Raging Phoenix, so that way they can't try to summon it out later on. They do have Whale, though. But, I mean, you could end the game through Whale, because it's not like Whale's really going to matter if we can get to full combo. And then, but the Raging Phoenix will, because they have Emergency in the Airlifter, or Preventer in the Airlifter, which is like the body. But yeah, I, I think, yeah, I'll let one Melfi Sprite into the tourney. Because they're playing a bunch of cool things in the deck. 
But that other person I was playing, Milfy Sprite, the one that uh that called me a noob, yeah, that person's not getting let in the tournament. They some ass. I gotta keep saying that in case they watch the stream, cause I want them to money match for me. So I gotta keep talking crazy to them. But Flame Bird summon back out from the graveyard. Bring out Populous, Snake Eye, Ash. Sure, sure, that's fine. That's good. Okay, so activate emergency. Go summon and send. So summon preventer, send preventer, preventer, summon airlifter, airlifter effect go search. That's good. Grab out headquarters. Uh oh. Hey me, because DB was glitching, I won two one. Okay. But I will update that in a second if DB didn't. So they called you a noob. I mean it's whatever. But they're playing Sprite Melfi. So I'm gonna go ahead, link off, they can make uh actually. Hmm. They don't have to go into like a princess. But hmm. You do that. Someone back. And then get that effect of summon back. Trying to find a way for game. It's like really close. Like if we don't have it, we are really close. But there's probably a way and I'm just not seeing it yet. This deck like always has game. Cause they could go Princess or they could go Hida. Or they could go Selene. Okay, okay, okay. Sling gain counters, lose counters, summon back out Black Witch. Also, it doesn't target. Now, does someone have the Coliseum Discord link? I do. I'm gonna go ahead and go boop. Call up. There you go. Okay, so access code gain attack, and then effect, banish. Then pops the princess. So now wait, they're thinking, because they have whale. Yeah, so think on res if they want a whale or not. Yeah. So they're gonna pop island, and island pops their field. I don't know if they know the last card in hand or not. Yeah, boop, that pops their field. I was thinking more like instead of Celine, said so should've chained. Um, because let's see, we could have gone Hida, take a link to make princess under Hida, summon back out from the graveyard. Oh, wait, we had Karen in hand, so we could go like bring out Ponix and then wait, could have also just gotten princess summon back out. Populous, and then you Snake Eye Ash plus Princess, Raging Phoenix, World Sea, Banish, Princess, pop their airlifter, summon out. Mm, you go Kieran first, so that way you can Kieran pop, but like that doesn't work. Wait, no, that does work. Yeah, because then you can Sky Crisis over the Raging Phoenix, right? Well, I guess you have Princess there that you gotta get rid of first. Oh, there had to have been a way for game. There had to have been a way. It's way too close for it to not be game there. Like, there, there had to have been a way. There's just a line. Mr. Grinder, can you accept me next time? I'm trying to play with Rico. Uh, I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. I, I just choose people. But also... Rika is uh, kind of rough post Phantom Nightmare. Yo, DBG with the goo, with cash. I have a friend who's asking. 
Uh, I mean, there's no like crazy goo. All, all, all the goos out there that I know of, at least for the duck. I mean, you can play Zephyrus, you can play Draco Sack. Either way, I mean, you play both, but you just, you just play those. Soul Release Go Banish. Or you can play the Heat Soul combo. Okay, that Soul Release is tragic for them. Yeah, they can banish a lot, but they have gone through Hita and stuff. And all they got was Headquarters Draw, so they might not have anything here. There's a chance that they don't have anything here. Go banish. Do you prefer Race or Fire King post Phantom Nightmare? I prefer Fire King post Phantom Nightmare. But they banish and then pass. Okay. I mean, it's not like the Fire King player is applying any pressure here at all. Like, well, I guess, okay. I guess there is pressure being applied because, like, any normal someone they haven't gone through Hida yet. Yeah, so let's go. Normal summon. Link off. Go ahead, summon out Hida. Is that Zephyros? Yep. Is that Pure Snake Eye? Oh, God, no. I mean, Pure Snake Eye is good for sure. I, don't, I mean, yeah. I mean, whatever deck you're playing, like, I feel like you should be playing Flame Burge and the Snake Eye cards because those cards give you infinite bodies. Personally, I just. I don't like the race deck over those decks. But Impulse Go Summon. Bring out Hydrant in response to the Hida, so the trap is live. They're gonna summon Princess, and then we have. I mean, they're gonna go Princess try to summon. We have the Contain. TG Snake Eye. Hey, TG Snake Eye right now doesn't even seem bad. But post Phantom Nightmare, there's just not enough extra deck space for it. But they're going to go ahead, contain, shut that down. There's also going to be more hand traps plus Phantom Nightmare than there is right now. Like, the deck's engines are stronger, and there's more hand traps. So, battle. Feed over Hydrant. They said, okay. Yeah, I mean, they can't really stop that. They could, like, start a battle link Karibo, but it doesn't change anything. Alright, so now, once again... We have draw for turn, and we have headquarters. So we're just trying to draw into a play. Headquarters go put back and draw. Then this draws into anything playable. Okay, there we go. Normal summon hydrant. That's play. That's playable for me. Well, is the goo with Zephyrus in cash? You summon it off Arsenal Falcon, but grab Preventer. You can probably just YouTube the combo. Probably someone that I mean, there's definitely people who have posted the combos. They're gonna go emergency, go set contain. Then let's see. That should just be game. They don't have their own princess in graveyard, right? Yeah, they don't have their own princess in their graveyard. So just banish, summon out preventer. I tried to find it but couldn't. Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know what to say. Got a big tourney next week. Should I go Fire King? Next week? No, 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 no. You should play probably like Rescue Ways. You can play Pearly. Pearly's kind of nice right now too. Battle Phase, Preventer, Beat Over Princess. Ah, uh, it's funny. It is funny how there's been a lot of people switching from Fire King to Pure Snake Eye. Yeah, I mean, like Snake Eye's good. Like any anything Snake Eye is... A lot better than the other decks, for sure. They're gonna go ahead and make SP. And then SP, Preventer, Banish, Summon back out. Personally, though, I'm more of a Fire King enjoyer myself. Then, pass turn. Mm-hmm. What did they draw? Leave main phase? Have you tested the Snake Eye deck? I have. I think it's good. I think, uh, like, Snake Eye, Fire King, Rescue Ace are all, like, at the top. And then there's, like, every other deck. Could be, could be wrong, could be wrong, but it's how it feels. Like, Pearly could end up being near the top if people aren't prepared for it or anything. 
Game two was not good for me. Nah, it, it happens. It happens. It happens. At least I didn't get full punished for it. What would you recommend for someone super budget just for locals? Okay, whoa, what, what's super budget? What's super budget? Let's see, prediction. And then we got no Gamba, no future. Won that one. No Gamba, no future, won the Gamba. I said suck. Okay. 150 non staples. Uh, okay, uh, I mean, non-staples, you could play a lot of different things. You could play, I don't, I mean, I don't know how much the Phantom Nightmare cards are going to cost, because obviously they're not out yet, but, I mean, you could play Pearly. Cause I, I count, I count SP Little Knight as a staple, too. That card is, like, 100% a staple. Okay. Also, let me let me fix that real quick for them if it didn't. I one two one. Nope. It eh, got it. Okay. And also, I'll mark them as the winner in a second too. Uh, we will win next time when I know Fire King better. So if you learn something, it's not a failure, just a learning experience. Yeah. Also, I think the next tourney I host. Is gonna be like a pay to enter tourney, so that way it can be like a way bigger prize pool and stuff like that. I think I think we're gonna do it like that for the next one. It's not gonna be like a huge pay to enter, and also be set up like probably like two days before or something. Huh? I have trigger effects first. Okay, chain link two, suck, target on summon, one of level six, you have to be chain link one. If you do it on Zep summon right now, you is chain link one, minus chain link two. Um, okay, I can't even tell what the game state is right now. I'm just gonna go to the logs. Oh, there we go. So they said, see, they summon, summon, summon. They said target pointed at pit knight. And then went pointed at that. They said signal okay. They declared the effect of Zep. They said on summon princess. Said when. You have to be chain link one. Mine's gonna be chain link two. Yeah, okay. So they're trying to princess pop right now. Okay. But. Said banish Zep. Why banish thinking here? Confused what this game state is. Uh, everything after make access code was incorrect on my part. Don't mind me. <laughs> nah, you're good. You're good. So struggling to resolve chain links is wild. I'm just struggling to know what's going on because we showed up in like the middle of this chain link. But okay, so I think princess is popping and then summon out. Okay. Uh, okay, okay, not popping Snopios, popping Pisces. Said no mine. Gosh. Hey, don't worry, this, this match is more rough than yours because I'm just trying to understand what's going on. Okay, pop. There we go. Okay, now new chain link. We have Zep. Okay, we have Arvata Chain Link 1. Okay, okay, okay. Arvata Chain Link 1. They have Zep. I can go quick synchro. Uh, I've got a regional tomorrow, which I'll just win. 2024 UK Natch Champ is real. God, yes. You got a regional tomorrow? Wait, isn't it? Oh, it's Friday. Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. But, bet. I expect you to win. I expect nothing less. Oh, a Phantasma there. So, a Phantasma can go. Special draw. Phantasma can't trigger. You use Zep first. Does this... Lock? 
Uh, discard a special summon, you can immediately after this effect resolve, synchro summon one fish synchro monster using this card. Doesn't Phantasm have to be chain link one? No. <laughs> Where'd they get that from? Nah, that's crazy. Because they played Salad, it's literally Bay Link's Gazelle, that's like the normal chain link. Okay. Sounds like they need to win this bat. I uh, also have a regional tomorrow. First one back after not playing for four years. God, yes. What deck are you playing? Honestly, bro, I want a full, like, oh my gosh. Also, my wrists have been feeling a lot better, for sure, which is nice. You know, it kind of sucks. I've, I've been having to take it easy, which I hate doing. It's so boring. It's actually the worst thing ever. Scrolling on the internet mindlessly hurts my soul so bad but besides that i can't wait i can't wait it's gonna be so nice it's gonna be so nice my wrist should be healed soon or at least healed enough and then i can actually play Yu-Gi-Oh again and actually be the one playing oh my gosh it's gonna be so beautiful i'm gonna play in regionals i want to play all the time well i guess i can't play all the time otherwise my wrists are gonna go back to being bad but i'm gonna play so much how can I join the tourney? Boop. Yeah, they're gonna go to circle. Uh, how you risk it like that in the first place? Um, cause I abuse them for like four years straight every single day, which is fine. I just wish I could do it again. Wish I could do it for the next four years, but okay, they're gonna banish special effect, banish, add back. That's good. Also, doesn't this make it unaffected? Light control. This is can't be destroyed. Okay, banish a fish from your hand or graveyard. Add a go team monster. If a fish is normal and special, while it's cursed in your graveyard, target a fish control, banish it. And if you do, add this card to hand. Okay. Follow. Yeah, yeah, Just, yeah. You, you, you gotta be on Twitch. I don't have the Coliseum Discord link. Honestly, I need to change my, my DB to where I don't accept messages from people when I'm streaming. Just cause, I don't know. I get so many messages. DBG already cooked Goblin Raiders. Goblin? Nah, God. I mean, that, that Goblin ain't very good. Goblin ain't the greatest. Uh, if I win, I get a deck profile for real. I'll get out the podcast camera and Zaza. Huh? <laughs> huh? You know, huh? You know, you know what Zaza means? That's crazy. Okay, they're gonna summon World Sea. And then Flame Bridge summon back. <laughs> Bring out Oak. <laughs> and bring out populace all right well, i should ask what do you think it means because i've i've heard some words in real life that i've heard forever and then in person or on the internet they mean different things like 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 if i like a goon nowadays is not like a goon on the internet is different than what it means in real life like in real life it means somebody that's like you know uh, pr pretty much like up to no good pretty much but on the internet it means like something completely else. Something completely different. 13 going on 30. <laughs> so weed question mark, yes. What'd you think? Yeah. So you're gonna pull out the podcast camera and the za for the video? <laughs> no one played Gold Pride Gold Pride Lab like Pack Tourney last night. I actually watched some of that match. Nobody cooking Raider after question mark. Is this still trash? Yeah. Oh God, yes. Up to no good on the internet. What it mean on the internet? I don't even know exactly what it means. It just means some weird stuff. That's all I've seen. I just know it doesn't mean what it actually means. The internet's just got a new meaning for it. But in real life, it don't mean that. Okay. Well, they are side ducking for the next game. We can go ahead and watch the other one if it's still going. Adios. Got Matrix versus 
Butterball. Matrix went first. We got we got Beauty set up. Didn't use its interruption on this. Probably have the trap card set up. What are the time rules? Oh, it's time right now. <laughs> it's time right now. Go ahead, go there. Doop. Um, time in round. Okay. Well, there we go. Oh, I probably should have told the other one that. We won one. End of phases this turn. And then. To be fair, Virtual World is a DB only deck, but yeah. Uh, so gift cards from deck, make the opponent have higher life and start cooking. Play, play Nurse Burn. Play Nurse Burn. Not zero, one, two, three. Well, okay. I mean, no, cause I, time was called like when this, game started right no yeah time was called like when this game started it was like literally time was called like as the game like started so i, I wouldn't say it's like that no if it was like game two and then time was called then we'd go into zero one two three turns and also, no side decking, you know, roll the dice, yada, yada, yada. But also, we can't really enforce no side decking on DB. Since there's no way to prove if somebody sided or not. Well, actually, I guess, yeah, there's, there's no way to prove it. Not, not after game two, because their deck would already be sided with. If it was after game one, then we could tell. Because I know what their main deck looks like. But they're going to grab out Snopios and then... Banish the Keef. Okay. Pass. So we got some fishes coming back. Oh god, yes. Oh, but they couldn't gang or burn life points. Yeah, they don't play the runic cards. If they played runic cards, that was like pfft, over. Easy. GG. But now they have to survive this turn without doing any without taking any damage which is going to be really hard to do. So, Imperbs, the Pacies, they got this, but don't do anything right now. Wait. Uh, yeah, we just got to do damage. So, I mean, hopefully they didn't brick. Otherwise, that's just like auto lose. Uh, we wait on timer for round two, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Should be done relatively soon. Let me let me see if the other match went to time. Uh, okay, I don't know if they said it or not, but time in round. Yep, forty five minutes. Just standard Konami single elimination time rules. Oh God, yes. Both players are nine k. Uh, so it checks end of every phase, right? This turn, it'll check end of every phase. After this turn, it's at end phase. Which can actually come up for Pearly. Because, like, next turn, they could activate my friend Pearly effect, pay 500, still go battle phase attack. And you wouldn't be able to do that if it was, like, end of every phase forever. But... Okay, uh, let's go back to the other match since we were watching that one already. Okay, so went Prosperity, grab something, normal out, Arvata, and then Bonfire. So I mean, they, they would have to fumble pretty bad to lose here, right? Since they have Arvata to stop a hand trap. Then they have Populous. Okay, well, I guess let's just see. Do they fumble? Do they fumble the bag? 
Okay, no Populous effect to search, so that means they have original in hand already. Populous, Bell and Trap Zone itself, original can go send and go summon. Chain Ash? Nope, okay. Uh, yeah, that's rough. Bring out Ponix. I guess maybe they're hoping that the Fire King player messes up. Or they have something like an impulse to try to go summon out. I mean, most likely it's just fire attacker draw and discard. <clears throat> like, almost guaranteed. Uh, flam wins here, right? Uh, like fire? Yeah, I think fire probably just wins here. They're gonna go Arvasa to shut down the impulse. Sure. That's fine. Um, we know the other card in hand's a fish, the Snopios. So I guess is the last card something real? Flame Burge. Attack over 24, then end turn. Uh yeah. Yeah, Flame Burge's game, Island's game. There's like infinite ways to win. We could also just like actually end the game. Like eight thousand to zero. There's just too there's too many ways to win here. That's what I'm saying. Like they'd have to fumble. Or the opponent would have to, huh? Probably, I mean, probably should have just went Flame Bird, right? Yeah, probably should have just went Flame Bird because that's just safer than this. Because it's like Arvata, Pop, Karibo, Original, Ash, Flame Bird, and then try to go battle Ho. Wait. Okay, so they popped a Keef. Sure. I mean, hopefully they don't find a way to mess this up. I don't think there is. Is uh, is there someone on Unchained by any chance? No, nah, there wasn't. There wasn't. Post Phantom Nightmare, it's gonna be really hard for that duck to work. Pre Phantom Nightmare, it's even hard for that duck to work. But. I gotta, I gotta test the deck some, because I saw the person who topped the, I think it was the German Open with the deck, and they weren't playing Disaster, so it's like, if they're not playing Disaster, but they're still full comboing and getting top 8, like, there's, you know what I mean, there's gotta be something that I'm doing wrong, so, okay, beat over, then they just submit defeat, okay, so on to...